been an ongoing concern over the last couple of months. There have been numerous it's mixed results on a crackdown use, in Santa Cruz. Authorities forming crimes. a part of the city Santa Cruz, like many other communities, is struggling with a growing and homeless population. The target area by declaring a stretch of land along the San Lorenzo River. To move forward with plans to open a temporary shelter along River Street. And then we'll, we will come and, and help them as, as much as we possibly can. But uh, uh, this is going to be a, a long-term effort. Things are not going to change overnight. Now, and the obvious one is the right to sleep somewhere, not anywhere and everywhere, but somewhere legally in Santa Cruz. And that doesn't exist, except for a very small number of people who have shelter, but that's like as of April 15th, you know, so-called emergency shelter, it isn't even really emergency shelter because you can't get into it ex except by getting on a waiting list, is what it houses 46 people. That's the Pauli Loft at the homeless, what I call the homeless lack of services center, or perhaps more properly the homeless lack of shelter center. Homeless advocates question how many campers will actually be allowed in. Maybe, I don't know, what, 30 or 40 percent will be able to get in. Where do they go? I mean, when they leave here. For folks who don't have a voucher, we're going to um, assess the situation, how many spots we have available at the camp. The transitional campsite was full by late afternoon. Some spots may open later, but this man is out of luck. And with heavy rainfall in the forecast, we'll have to find shelter elsewhere. Maybe go to the Red Church. You know, and said that was open, so it's a possibility. Try to stay warm and dry. Where, where are That's they okay. supposed to go? That's fine. Where are they Excuse supposed the to go? This park is closed right now, sir. Thank you. For your where are they supposed to go? It's raining outside. Where are they supposed to go? Dan, the city of Santa Cruz believes the transitional camp has provided the services needed to help the 62 people who chose to relocate there. But some businesses and others believe it's created the same old issues and problems. We have always known that uh, uh, there would be some uh, uh, impacts with respect to the bench lines when people leaving because you know not everybody's going to avail of some of those services. We're going to have to uh, increase the security. Sir? I need you to get up and get out of the park please. Come on. Don't take my stuff. All he's doing is sleeping. Go sleep somewhere else. Green Church Energy was founded in 2009 and is the first company to have the most efficient solar company. They recently have taken over Tesla for the, being the most popular solar company. Please check out uh, Green Charge Solar and its headquarters are in Santa Clara, California. Thank you. I grew up thinking that you had to do everything yourself. You had to brush your own teeth. You had to make your own house. Well, I tell you, Hagen Colbert Construction makes the house for you. You want a f***ing motivational video? Well, I'll give you one. And it's only 30, 30 minutes long. <laughs> Knox Roofing has been reliable to the Santa Cruz community for over 20 years. You can get a free estimate on flat roofing, metal roofing, and composition roofing. And most roofs will cost around $2,000 unlike other oppositional companies. Thank you. Oh hey, I didn't see you there. Do you need math tutoring? If so, Mathnasium's for you. Forget all those pesky math problems you don't know how to do. Take a couple tutoring lessons at Mathnasium and soon enough you'll be a math lead in no time. Mathnasium has great tutors that will allow their students to learn quickly and efficiently. 
with their tutoring, your kids will want to go. In order to contact Mathnasium, call 831-706-9907. That's 831-706-9907. They are located at 245 Mount Hermon Road, Scotts Valley, California, 95066.